the main reason why a house doesn't sell is because it was priced too high. And unfortunately, there's too many realtors out there who are just willing to tell you what you want to hear so they can get the listing agreement. And that usually means uh, agreeing to list the house at a price that they know is too high. So the rest of this video, I'm just going to explain what market value is and how we determine it. So market value is defined as the price that an able buyer is willing to pay in today's market. The way that we determine that is by looking at the recently sold homes, what homes are currently for sale, and what the market is doing at the moment and where we expect it to go. So when we look at the recently sold homes, ideally we're looking for homes that are similar to yours in size, age, features, amenities, condition, all those things as similar as possible to yours and that they have sold in the last six months in your neighborhood. So everything, we're comparing apples to apples and we wanna be current in time. We're trying to get the pulse of the market right now. So if we have to expand any of that criteria, we do, but that's what's ideal. But that's important because that tells us what, you know, those homes actually sold. So that tells us what buyers have been willing to pay re very recently for a house like yours. Secondly, we look at what the homes that are currently for sale in your neighborhood, how do they compare to your home? Because that's your competition. When a buyer is looking in your neighborhood at your house, they're gonna look at the other houses in your neighborhood as well if they're in the same uh, price and condition and, and features that they're looking for. So you wanna make sure that when they see your home, they see a greater value for the price or at least a competitive value for the price. Otherwise, you'll never get an offer. And lastly, we wanna look at what the market is doing. The real estate market uh, changes over time and it actually has a seasonal cycle to it. It has a rhythm, it goes up and down. And so we wanna make sure we know where we're at in that cycle and what we, where we can expect prices to go in the next couple of months. Do we expect them to go up or down? And that will determine whether we price your house on the upper end of the range that makes sense or on the lower end of the range that makes sense. So we do all this to make sure that your house is priced correctly when it hits the market because the first 10 days on the market are the most important because that's when your house is gonna have the new uh, status in the MLS. That's when it draws the most attention. So if you don't have it priced correctly in that time window, you face a, a lot bigger of a challenge of your house likely becoming one of those stagnant listings. And when a, when a listing becomes stagnant, it, it, it's been on the market a long time and buyers and agents start to wonder what's wrong with it. If you'd like to talk more about pricing strategies and learn the value of your home in today's market, just reach out to me and I'd love to chat with you about that. Thanks for watching my video and I hope to hear from you. Have a good one.